With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The given question is, 1000 small water drops, each of radius r and charge small q, coalesce together to form one that of the smaller drop, smaller one by a factor of the given options are 1000, 100, 10 and 1. So we are having, see we have 1000 small water drops, okay, like this, that have, that have formed to, that has coalesced to become a bigger spherical drop, okay, so that have joined together we can say to form a bigger spherical drop okay so let's assume the radius of the bigger spherical drop be capital r and for the smaller spherical drop be small r okay so now see this thousand smaller water drops okay have combined to form this bigger one so volume must remain constant so we will have the volume of the thousand smaller uh, water drops that is 1000 into 4 by 3 pi small r cube must be equal to the volume of this bigger water drop right that is 4 by 3 pi into capital R cube okay so from here we can cancel out 4 by 3 pi and we will get capital R cube equals to 1000 small r cube and from here I can write that the radius of the bigger water drop would be equal to 10 times of smaller radius of the smaller drops right so let this be equation number one next we have c for a spherical conductor we have the capacitance given as c equals to 4 pi epsilon naught r okay so let's say this c is the capacitance for the smaller drops and we have the capacitance c dash for the for this bigger drop okay so we will have c dash equals to 4 pi epsilon naught into capital r okay so if i take the ratio of c dash over c we will get capital r by r okay so this ratio is equal to 10 only because r by r ratio is 10 so from here we will get the capacitance of the bigger drop would be equal to 10 times the capacitance of the smaller drops okay let this be equation number two next we have is the charge okay now see let small q be the charge on the smaller drops and capital Q be the charge on the bigger drop so the thousand drops are having charge Q right see thousand drops are having charge small Q so the capital Q charge on the bigger drop would be equal to how much thousand times of smaller charge Q because they all have combined to make this bigger drop okay let this be equation number three so now we have to find the potential ratio okay so we know that potential is given as the ratio of charge over capacitance so i can write the potential let's say v for the smaller drops will be given as q over c okay and for the bigger drop it can be written as v dash equals to capital q over c dash now we have to take the ratio of potential of bigger drop to the smaller drop okay so we will have to find the ratio of v dash over v so it will found out to be q over c dash divided by q over c so i can write this as q by q into c over c dash right so here i can write the ratio would be equal to now see capital q is thousand times of small q by equation three so i can put the value next is we have the value of c dash is 10 times of c okay by equation two so from here we can cancel out the common terms in thousand we can cancel out by 10 so we will get the ratio of the potential of the bigger drop to that of smaller drop is thousand is hundred times okay is hundred times so from the given options we have a b c and d option b is the correct answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today